As you can see from the title of this video, I've got a secret. And a secret is a dieting secret. Shall I tell them? And it's not a food, and it's not a drink. I want you to try and guess it in your head. All right, fuck it, I'm gonna tell you. My dieting cheat code is I've done this before. When it comes to prep or fat loss in general, your first dieting phase is going to be shit. Like, really fucking bad. You're gonna make mistakes, you're probably gonna binge, you're just not gonna be well equipped for what dieting presents you. Now obviously if you've got a coach, and I really recommend hiring a coach for your first prep or, or fat loss phase, whatever, just so they can basically warn you of things you're about to do and warn you of things that potentially could happen on a daily basis. Because yeah, if you do this by yourself, again, especially for prep, <sighs> Welcome to a welcome to a tough 17 to, to 20 weeks. So I've taken many things away from my previous dieting phases and I've basically applied it to to the next dieting phase. So the last prep I was taught a lot about myself. Previous one, I learned a lot. Previous one to that, you get the gist. I learned different things from different preps and take it into the next prep. So ultimately what happens is every single fat loss phase I do becomes easier and that is a dieting cheat code and i did say i was going to a stag do at the weekend and i'd film but it was near impossible to film but here's a good example of a dieting cheat code i went to a stag do in 2018 pretty much exactly the same event as i just had to be honest celebrating one of my mates stag do's obviously anyway cut a long story short um, it didn't end very well for me i ended up starving myself for meals and when i did eventually eat i binged a lot and that binge episode really killed that fat loss phase it took me about two or three weeks to get back to where i was which isn't great now after going through a similar event i know what i did to fuck up and i know what not to do for this one and guess what happened i didn't fuck up because i knew what to expect i knew how to handle certain situations and i was genuinely just more prepared for the occasion and this will happen with things like family events things like birthdays etc your first dieting phase is gonna suck really bad but use that as a learning tool there's many events in which i fucked up however i don't regret the fuck up because essentially i know now not what to do I think that makes sense. Another example is things like food composition. So in 2017, I tried to do everything within my power to try and have like protein pancakes and all this kind of good stuff. And then I realized something. You're actually making yourself hungrier by trying to play towards that style um, of food. Things like Halo Top, things like protein donuts. I was really trying to integrate all that into my diet when I was on reasonably low amounts of calories, which meant ultimately in the day I was just starving the whole time. So in 2018, I tweaked it. And in 2021, I tweaked it further. This one, yeah, you guessed it. It's been tweaked again. Like, I don't know if you remember the last prep I did and I was kind of dieting on Cocoa Pops, which was kind of cool to show you guys that you can diet on Cocoa Pops. However, if I dieted on Cocoa Pops right now, on the calories that I'm on, I would be super super hungry so yeah there's a there's a dieting hack there's a dieting cheat code experience if this is your first fat loss phase if this is your first prep and you are fucking up um you have fucked up learn from it you are gonna fuck up totally normal however the next one you do is gonna be better the next one you do is gonna be better the one after that is gonna be better right so yeah if you're going into your first prep going into your first fat loss phase number one hire a coach <laughs> do that number two yeah you're gonna fuck up a few times but that's totally normal and it's okay however experience anyway very cool stag do for the weekend actually i wasn't train at m10 but pff, they didn't let me in uh, because i wasn't a member so very weird setup in my opinion uh however we got it done uh new low this morning so all in all good you'll get your update monday so yeah, speak to you soon.